Well, my oven has decided to go on strike. And it is about 17 years old, so I guess it's about time for a little teenage rebellion. Well, you know, pretty soon I'll be 18 and I won't have to listen to anything you say. The stove is still working just fine. So it's not the entire range, it's just the oven portion, which leads me to believe that it's probably the igniter. Before I do anything, I definitely want to unplug this and shut off the gas. And did you know that natural gas actually has no scent? They add the scent to it so that you can smell if you have a gas leak. Hmm. Now, to find the igniter on your gas oven is going to be a little bit different depending on your model, so you may have to look that up on your manufacturer's website. But on mine, I love this light, it's so cool, <laughs> uh, it is actually down here by the broiler. So i got to take these out first. Oh, they might twist out on this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Aha, there it is. This igniter is so obviously damaged that I am certain that this is the issue going on here. If it wasn't so obvious, you would want to hook this up to a multimeter to check for continuity, but this is so obviously compromised that I'm going to order a new one uh, and just get it installed in a couple of days. It's very unlikely that I'd be able to find this exact part locally. Uh, they just don't sell parts that way anymore. But luckily, there's lots of websites you can go on to order parts specific to your appliance. Just make sure you're matching the exact model number with the part number. Make sure all those numbers are matching up properly. actually have to take the door off on this it's just a lot easier to get to and mine's actually very easy to pull off so why not Let's see if it's gonna work. Hey! Woohoo! Awesome. Uh oh. My ring's caught. My hand is caught on my ring. <laughs> Damn you, big diamond! Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. My sciatica is killing me! Oh, <laughs> oh,